Traditional versus Roth IRA? Which one is better for you? Heard of an Individual Retirement Arrangement IRA? It's like a secret weapon for saving for retirement. There are two types, Traditional IRA and Roth IRA. Traditional gives you tax deductions, and you're taxed when you use the money. It's all yours, but if you're not around, it goes to your beneficiaries. To play the IRA game, you need income, wages, tips, or self-employment. No age limit for contributing after 2019. But not all cash counts, so check the rules. Traditional IRA means tax deduction now, but you pay taxes when you withdraw. Roth IRA means paying taxes now, but it's tax-free when you withdraw. Think of it like seeds, traditional, becoming taxable fruits, and Roth seeds being taxed, but turning into tax-free fruits. When cashing out traditional IRA, some might be taxable. One rollover per year rule, a 10% early withdrawal penalty, before 59 and a half, exceptions exist, and mandatory distributions after 73. Now, Roth IRA contributions aren't deductible, but qualified withdrawals are tax-free. Make sure it's designated as a Roth IRA from the start. In 2023, the IRA contribution limits stand at $6,500 for individuals under 50 and $7,500 for those aged 50 and older. For 2024, the limits increase to $7,000 for those under 50 and $8,000 for individuals aged 50 or older. It's essential to be aware of these figures and plan your contributions accordingly to maximize your retirement savings. Hi, this is Evangeline G. Ron, an enrolled agent and the founder and principal consultant of Evangeline G. Ron, Incorporated which is based in Los Angeles, California. My office serves more than 2,000 clients from all over the U.S. since 2008. I am committed to sharing informational and educational tax and finance videos to empower taxpayers.